My name is Lian Adamsone. I will be introducing you to spiritual dance. In spiritual dance, we connect our energy centers, emotions, and we express our emotions and feel balanced after we've been able to do it. So first part, we'll be connecting to our energy centers with the movement. Then we'll be connecting to four elements, earth, air, fire, and water. And the last part will be our emotions. Expressing emotions is very important in life. And this dance form is amazing because you get to move and let yourself be the way you feel like it. Enjoy! Nature has always been a big part in my life. Whenever I would feel sadness or any emotion, I would express it in nature, touching the trees, lying on the ground, playing with the water, swimming, and effect afterwards was so powerful. It was like a switch from one emotion to another emotion. Every time the nature communicated with me. Chakra balance. Imagine your seven energy centers blooming like colorful flowers. First energy center, root chakra. Standing on one leg, fingers crossed, hands at your root chakra. Navel chakra, leg moves a little bit up, hold your balance. Solar plexus chakra, holding balance. Heart chakra, holding balance. Throat chakra. Third eye chakra. And crown chakra, holding balance on tippy toes. Second part, energy comes from earth into your body. It visualize it as a bright light going through your chakra centers, going upwards and coming out into universe. Visualize the bright light cleansing your chakra centers. Downwards from universe, through your crown chakra, into your body, downwards, switching hand position, going into earth. Visualize the bright light cleansing your chakra centers. Upwards, bright light is cleansing your chakra centers. And downwards, Energy fountain, stand straight, visualize the bright light going through your chakra centers, cleansing your body and coming out into universe. Open your arms wider in a V shape and imagine it's coming out of your body as a fountain, cleansing your centers purifying your body energy coming from earth through your body into universe now we're going to switch the direction coming from universe into your body through your crown chakra going through your energy centers into earth visualize the bright light cleansing your centers bringing pure energy to your body. Now imagine a little seed planted that's going to grow like a flower. Let's pretend it's going to be a tulip. We planted a tulip. Now the seed is full of energy to come out of the earth and it comes out of the earth as a bud and it's full of energy to start moving. There's energy source that wants to bloom, keeps moving. And now it's starting to bloom into a beautiful red tulip or whichever flower you'd like to imagine. And you make this life energy source around yourself. Open your arms, create energy around yourself. 
and more and more energy and bigger circles, more motion. And now just observe that energy that you created and bring it back to your body. The best way to connect to four elements is in the nature. I have come here to connect to water, which is right here. Sun, Pi is my fire, it's up here. Earth and air. And you can move the way you feel it, the way you want it. You can feel the water on your feet, enjoy the feeling, move, dance in the water, connect to this element. You can splash it, feel it splashing on you, feel it on your skin. Take in the heat of the sun, feel your body getting hot from the beams of the sun. Connect to earth, touch it, feel it, connect, let it be. And air. Feel the blue sky, move like a sky. Dance and feel these four elements being complete in your body. All four elements. Water is in you, fire, earth, and air. You are complete. feel happy, complete. You can sit and enjoy the moment. Let your spirit dance. Observe the effects, feelings. What did this bring to you? You can do these exercises at home. So you bring the feeling with you. Bring it to your room. Create on right side earth on left side air in front of you fire behind you water and connect to four elements feel complete this tree has been here so many years many many more years than i was on this earth and connecting to the energy of the tree feeling it hugging it is connecting to something much bigger than a human being. It's silent, but it's so powerful. It can survive all the weathers. I breathe in the energy of the tree. One of the very important things in life is to express your emotions, what you're feeling. Whether it's negative or positive, you need to let it out. And that's part of how you connect to yourself. Feeling sadness for no reason. We wake up in the morning and there's sadness. Why? Start moving. Let the sadness out. I imagine being a bird and flying and connecting to the nature, looking on earth from up high and connecting to earth and letting the sadness out. Let it go. Move the way you feel. With the movement, the emotion comes out. It's a good idea at the end to connect to a positive emotion. Let's say love. Love surrounds us everywhere. We're surrounded with love. This earth, this grass, it's love. Your body, your spirit, the sky, the trees around you, water, air, it's full of love, wants to give you love. Open up your heart and take it in. Express yourself with the movement of love. Love yourself and love your surroundings and be happy.